90F and this is a tutorial on how to make a six bar. First you take one C channel, two C channels, and then you put a bearing block at each end with two screws like so. Then you take, you do the same on this side, on the other C channel. Then you take one long screw and put it through the end of one of the bearing blocks and screw on a nylock nut. Then you take one catch nut and screw it on and you have the nylock nut on to keep the thing, to keep the screw fastened onto the bearing block and you have the catch nut on to allow the joint to rotate freely. Once you screw on the catch nut, Place the other C channel perpendicular to the C channel in front of you, and then take take a nylock nut and screw it on the end. Once you have that, then unscrew the unscrew the nylock one full turn so that it's allowed to rotate freely around to uh, that allows the two C channels to rotate freely. Then this is what a rotating joint looks like once it's finished. And to show you, to give you an example, this is an example of a fully finished six bar lift. There are one, two, three, four, five, six C channels that are all connected with the rotating joint that I previously showed you. And this is, and there are six C channels, hence the name of a six bar. Once you finish building a six bar, then you attach it to a to to, to to towers and using the appropriate gear ratio. Then the, this last C channel will be perpendicular to the ground so that whatever it's holding will be parallel to the ground. In VEX Turning Point, this year's game, game you have to hold caps and this, this type of bar, six bar, allows you to hold the caps parallel to the ground, helping you put the, place the caps on the post. I hope this, you found this tutorial helpful and please subscribe to our channel.